Goodness. Police were in the bus right out of the gate. I listen, people know what they're getting involved in. And if they're not into it, they know that right off the bat. And I think that's good. I think there's something to be said for that. Uh, back in the day of Charles Dickens, they had these things called Magdalene laundries, which is where sinful uh, young women went who got themselves in trouble, if you catch my drift, or were suspected of doing so. And uh, so you literally could have something like an orphanage with, you know, adult women in it who were suspected of being very naughty in their sex parts. So they would have been the fat. I think it's probably. <laughs> yeah. They just like you take a really big shit. It was like a nine month fat camp. And <laughs> at the end of it, you go home and you're skinny again. So right, it's like and magic. you have a burrito. <laughs> but you set the burrito off to live with relatives by the sea, so it can have a better life. Is that code for eating it? Oh, my nose is bleeding. Maybe I shouldn't have sold that right. humidifier. Right. When I wake up in the middle of the night and I can't breathe because I'm completely desiccated. Yeah. So it got here today and I got it plugged in right before. So I'm really excited to maybe sleep through the night tonight. So what right, about really. this waking up completely desiccated? Do you think you're actually trying to molt mm. and then like a shiny Amanda is underneath? I don't think so. I haven't noticed any, like, scales or feathers or large flakes of skin anywhere. Well, I was thinking more like a bug, like a cicada. Like, you might have, like, a, a completely desiccated Amanda shell that's ready to come off any time now. I don't know. I, I try to exfoliate that shit as much as possible. So <laughs> I, I'm just saying that if you shed your outer skin, save it. I like to collect those, like, the cicada moltings. Are you going to eat it? Because I... That's gross. Can neither confirm nor deny that. I don't like that. Ah, ah, ah. Mm. So yes, if you are also playing Pocket Camp, um, <laughs> right I now you could be playing Pocket Camp while you watch us. If you are also playing with your Pocket Camp, don't tell us about it. Just do it privately. We're okay <laughs> with it. We just don't want to hear about it. I keep, I keep reiterating this like it's actually happened. Right. It hasn't. Please don't be the first. But even That's then, it. if I'm like dressed in normal clothes and a hot pair of shoes, it's not it's not hot. Now it just looks weird. Right. I'm, yeah. I'm just saying you need more than a pair of fucking shoes, dude, bro. Also, yeah. even in an open casket, you don't see their feet. <laughs> oh yeah. So But Jesus does. Jesus sees everything. Hey Jesus, my eyes are up here. <laughs> Jesus knows if your feet are sexy or not. Hey, Jesus, my shoes are down here. Hey, Jesus, feet are gross. <laughs> feet are gross. No, Amanda, have you ever had your toes sucked? This is Jesus. Yes, I have, and I do not like it. Jesus wants to suck your toes. No. No, Amanda, there's nobody's feet that are grosser than mine. They got holes in them. They're all bloody. I don't know why Jesus sounds like that for me, but he does. <laughs> There's an 18-hour window in which Christmas music is allowed. <laughs> 18 hours. It's from 6 p.m. on Christmas Eve until noon on Christmas Day. <laughs> that is the only time it's allowed. Only time. Porgs sing a Christmas carol from my ass. I open up my ass cheeks and all the porgs pop out like a flower bouquet and they all out of my ass. I might actually want to see that because that sounds entertaining. <laughs> I never remember going like fucking ape shit for Christmas the way some people do. I mean, listen, whatever makes people happy. I, like, you know. I guess, but if what makes them happy is playing Christmas music in October, then they need to die. Okay. <laughs> that seems a bit extreme. Nope. They belong with it, Dan Brown being skinned alive it, and shot into the sun. It does seem extreme, but I don't know that I disagree with her. <laughs> <laughs> they all support us on Patreon. You can also support us on Patreon. Give us your money, please. Give
give us your money, please.